What's up everyone? I'm back here with another video today. Today I'm talking about my gym bag essentials. I did want to take a second to say congratulations to Kendrick Ferris. Uh, and his performance at the Pan Am Games. He won the gold medal there, and he went five for six in all his lifts, which is an amazing performance. So congratulations to him, and let's move on to the video. So the first thing I wanted to talk about are wrist straps. I use wrist straps on pretty much a daily basis, and the ones that I use are the Mark Bell Slingshot wrist strap. So they're flexible, they're made out of neoprene, so you can kind of wrap them around as tight or as loose as you want them to. Um, the only thing, of course, with anything made out of neoprene, is that you have to wash these on the regular because they do end up accumulating odors over time. Um, but they are definitely a great wrist shop to have. My initial thought was that they were super bulky, which they kind of are, but they provide really great stability for your wrist. The next thing I wanted to mention are knee sleeves. I use the Ray-Ban ones. I've had these for like probably two and a half years now, and they're just as good as new. Um, I definitely love wearing knee sleeves. They keep my knees warm. My knees tend to crack, and they do have pain uh, when I'm putting a lot of pressure on them. Um, with repetitive movements and stuff like that. So this is a great thing to have for me. Okay, next thing I wanted to talk about are weightlifting straps. So this is from Iron Mind and I got these from Amazon for about 12 bucks. Pretty cheap. I probably use these like pretty much on a daily basis for, you know, deadlifting, um, for like long complexes. Okay, next thing that I use on a pretty much daily basis is my belt. This is from Illigo. And I'm in love with this belt. I seriously haven't had a belt that I've loved so much. And I just love the color scheme, of course, white and navy blue, you can't go wrong with that. And um, the leather belt I love because it just provides a lot of stability and it makes me feel very secure. Another thing that I love is how there's padding in the back, so it's very, very comfortable. I always have to have my weightlifting shoes. As a weightlifter, weightlifting shoes are pretty important. They just make you feel really stable. And it, it does have an elevated heel, so if you don't have as much ankle flexibility, then um, you can get away with it a little bit with the heel. But I wear the Nike Romaleos. I did have the Adidas shoes, um, the Addy Power, I believe is what they were called, the white ones. But I do actually like the Romaleos a little bit better. And if you guys want a side-by-side -side comparison on that, I can definitely do that. Just let me know in the comments below. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to some of the mobility tools that I bring with me in my gym bag. First thing is going to be another slingshot product. This is the Hip Circle. And I definitely think this is a great tool to have. It's definitely a simple concept but it's made very well. It has just the right amount of tension and um, it's just a really great tool to have for yourself. And also if you're a trainer, it's great to have for your clients as well. So um, yeah, this is a really great way to warm up your hips and your glutes before squatting or doing any type of lower body movements. Next thing that I bring with me up just about anywhere is my Supernova 2.0. Um, I got this from Rogue, and it is a bit pricier than your average lacrosse ball, but I definitely do think this is one of my essential items. Um, the ridges really do help get work into your tissue better. Supernova 2.0 is worth it to me, in my opinion. Okay, so the newest addition to my mobility kit is the Theracane. I think this was on Amazon for about 30 bucks. But this is great to really just work into your back muscles that are really hard to get into. I think I'm definitely going to be using this a lot in my near future. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to some miscellaneous items that I have floating around in my gym bag. The first thing I'm going to mention is my bag of resistance bands. This is by Black, Mount Oops, Black Mountain Products and I already opened it because I was this is like my 40th take apparently. This is a really great thing to have when you're in a pinch and you don't have anything else to, um, to do your assistance exercises with. Next miscellaneous item is my Jaybirds. So when I don't like the music in the weight room, I will wear my Jaybirds and just get in my own zone. They connect by Bluetooth so you don't have a wire constantly in your way while you're lifting, which is, um, 
a big deal. So this is a great thing to have for me. Okay, next thing I like to have in my gym bag is some backup deodorant. So I like to use Old Spice. I know I'm a girl, I shouldn't be using Old Spice. I should be using like Secret or Dove or something like that. But I really love Old Spice. I've been using it forever and they have some um, scents that aren't as manly. So this one is the Fresh High Endurance deodorant. I absolutely love the smell of this and honestly, like let's keep it real, I do sweat a lot when I work out. So, um, you know, I'm not ashamed to admit it, okay? That means I'm putting in work. You should be sweating when you're working out. I mean, that's, you're working out, like, you know, you're gonna sweat. And for me, it works better than a girl's deodorant, honestly. I just think that Old Spice works really great for me. So if anyone was wondering what kind of gym bag I use, it's nothing special. I'm just using an Under Armour Volt green gym bag. I got it from Amazon for about like 30, 20 bucks. And the reason why I like it so much is because it holds a lot of stuff. I mean, it holds everything I just mentioned. And it has a little compartment for my shoes, which I like keeping my shoes separate from all my other equipment just because it's cleaner that way. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and yeah, let me know what your gym bag essentials are in the comments below. I'm interested to see um, what everyone else has in their gym bag out there. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!